In the summer of 2020, an opportunity revealed itself. Our friend Yako suggested a trip to our beautiful Lapland. Immediately, we were in and started planning this expedition. The trip started early on a Friday morning in August. We had a solid 12-hour drive from Uvascula to finish Lapland. Our destination, Tangavara Gold Village. Se meni aika hankalaksi, niin, niin. tosi nopeasti. Ja sitten sit monta kesää meni silleen, että, että se ei aina vaan niin siirty ja siirty. Joo. Nyt viime vuonna onnibussi alkoi ajaa niin kuin siitä ohi. Joo. Mutta se kestäisi 15 tuntia niin suuntaisesti. <laughs> niin sitten tiedätkö silleen, että on ollut 20 siellä ja 30 tuntia lippissä. Niin <laughs> sitten ehkä toi Sami, Sami tuli kynnyksen terdelle ja sitten se vaan sanoi sitä, että että aijaa, että pari viikon päästä alkaa kesälomaa, niin kun heitin ilmoille, että vittu, niin lähdetäänkö kaivaa kulmaa. Ja Sami ei tuossa siitä niin samaan tee. Sitten Sami varmaan laittoi siinä vaiheessa sulle jo viestiä, ja sitten Janne tuli katsoi siihen terdepöytään. Sitten että nyt on kuule, nyt on kovaa juttuja. Siinähän alkaa olla auto täynnä. Siis tolleen niin tosi helposti. Joo, ihan niin, paljon. Sitten se niin napsaa niin sieltä vihdoinkin. Kyllä. Weather's nice. Trip's going well. Stuck behind these <laughs> caravan. <laughs> the same caravaner for past like 200k. We'll make it eventually. But what are we like? 80, 70 kilometers from Oulu? No, no. More like 57. 57. Yeah. Okay. I think it's about time for a lunch break. Yeah, I think so. What was it? Swing? Swing. 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 <laughs> Barbecue and grill. Or, so, or something like that. Yeah, I, I believe Road it's stop. more like grill. Without yeah. the barbecue. No. No barbecue. Just the grill. Tää nykyy nuoret, ei ne muuta kuin somee. Näinpä. Ne on just on muuten. I think 
we're just about to enter into Lapland and the road keeps getting smaller and smaller. And I guess I can do this. But you know, that's, that's what it's like when you drive far enough north, you, you end up running out of road. Yeah. So, just uh. Or at least you're running out of pavement road. You can barely fit two, two cars on. As, as <laughs> yeah, that was pretty tight. <laughs> Several so hundred to Romania, me. Yeah, 120. 120 to Romania, me. And then another couple hundred. 280, about. So 400 till till we are Tankovara. No Tankovara. Yeah, the gold village. Blueberry pie with the vanilla ice cream and whipped cream. Very tasteful. Santa Claus Village, but we're stopping off at the Arctic Circle post line. It's it's actually a line that you know, like when you have a globe, it's got the lines that go around for the Arctic Circle and the equator. It, it's yeah. like they're, you know, it's pretty wide on the on the globe. It's the same size on when you go past the Arctic Circle. There's an actual line that you. Yeah, yeah just the, like the painted line. Yeah, yeah, exactly. On the, on the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you can see it there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what is it? Sixty? Is it sixty-six point six degrees or sixty-three point? Sixty-six point six. Yeah, that must be. Yeah, that must be. Sounds like Santa. No, the Arctic Circle. What latitude is it? Yeah. Oh come on. In Yako's home, back when he was a child, there was the different Santas. Okay, it wasn't sixty-six point six, but I was close. The position of the Arctic Circle is not fixed and currently runs at sixty-six degrees, thirty-three minutes, and forty-eight point two seconds an angle so there you go north of the equator now we're coming up on it So we made it to Sodankylä. Sodankylä, translated directly to English, is war town or town of war. Yeah, here is an uh, annual film festival take place in here. Yeah, it's called the Midnight Sun Film Festival. And, and the idea with the film festival is that it goes on for 24 hours or like something is being shown 24 hours a day. And seeing as the sun doesn't actually go down up here in the north, no. uh, it, it stays on the horizon for the whole 24 hours of the, of the day. So uh, you actually forget about what time it is at. So 4 a.m. and 4 p.m. look the same, mm -hmm. which, which is crazy. But, uh, yeah. Come visit the film festival. Yeah, I've been able to. The mies ulkoiluttaa tuota koiraa, mitä menee sieltä tuolta poroja kanssa. Tää on kyllä jotenkin, tää on villipohjalla. Niin on. Tää on niin jonkin. Tuo koirakaan välitä niistä mitään. Onks se tästä? No. Kunnon Jurassic Park-portti täällä. 
<coughs> Check that out. Kultakylää ilmeisesti sinne. After a long day of driving and many points of interest later, we arrived in Tankavara Gold Village just in time for a late dinner. The restaurant Vanha Vaskolimies provided us with many delicious meals during our stay. The group favorite, sautéed reindeer with mashed potato and lingonberry sauce. If you're driving by, we highly recommend stopping for a meal. Pyyhkeen koti, että se oli ainut mitä mä olin. Mun mielestä siellä oli tuolla pyyhkeen. No niin, nyt aika tota autenttinen. Onko? Oo. Oh. Hyvin helkkari. Sinnehän on pakko pistää jotkut valkeat tänään vielä. Näillä keleillä. Siis todellakin. Saadaan vielä, vielä parempaa niin kuin matskeja. This is authentic. You know? We are now in the proper gold mining cottage, you know? Kämppä. So I believe that these, uh, all these cottages were built in somewhere in uh, 1700 or the century, the 17th century. Were they really? Yeah, of course. <laughs> and the actual gold miners have lived in these. You can still smell their sweat. Blood, sweat and beers. Yeah. Beard. Beards. Yeah. <laughs> After a very tasty dinner, we went exploring the gold village. A western village, Auraria, has a collection of old buildings that are direct reproductions from historical North American gold rush cities, such as Donson City in Canada. Beyond Auraria lies the heart and soul of the gold village, the gold panning site, where many people have tried their luck at finding the biggest nugget since it first opened in the summer of 1970. We spent the evening exploring the area, and in hindsight, one could say we didn't even know half of the awesomeness that we were going to experience. I found one. What? Rock? Yeah. But isn't this white, white or almost transparent rock? The very sign of gold. This could be holding inside. I don't know. Could be.